And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And we're fully convinced this game will live up to its billing. It's Portimonense up against Celtic. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, hitting the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. Tilio. An alert piece of defending. Mufi. Well, that's wonderful attacking play. Well read to ease the pressure. Chance to do damage. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Can they nudge in front? And a goal to open the scoring. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, this is a very tidy finish, as you can see. He's under so much pressure, but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly. It's an excellent goal. Back underway, 1-0 it is. Oh, lovely weighted ball, they might be in. Now a decent position. Nicely saved. Over it comes. As a go! Oh, that was begging to be put home, but the goalkeeper has it. Now, let's see what they can do here. Options in the centre. And caught with ease, no real threat from the cross. High quality defending. Marco Tilio. And he takes on the shot, and saved by the keeper. And he's fired over the corner, not messing around with that clearance. Well, a badly timed run, just a fraction offside. <laughs> and a poor ball. Just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. 
Well, he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. So, back underway, and an intriguing second half in prospect. Decent position. Crossing opportunity. Can they convert? Oh, blocked it! Estrella. Can he finish? Well denied by the keeper, but really he only has himself to blame. Hatate. Callum McGregor. And Moy with it. Can they do something positive on the counter attack? Superb block. Magnificent defending. Taylor Rio Hatate promising attack this using space on the opposite flank now and it might be and a goal they've added to the lead much needed security Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. <laughs> 2 0 here, and the ball is moving again. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. But it looked as though he might be on to something, but his timing left a bit to be desired. Yeah, that's frustrating, because he's just been too impatient there. He doesn't need to make his movement quite so early. Well, no surprise there. Celtic have had more of the possession. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Yes, it might be on for them once more. Well, he really wants his brace. Well, he looks so bright today. His movement has been excellent. And time for the change now. Not a short corner here. Tilio. It's with Carter Vickers, and the keeper more than equal to the task. But he's gone short with it. Marco Tilio. And reading it absolutely superbly. Almost at full time. And I'll tell you what, playing away from their home patch has been a pleasant experience for them, Stuart. Well, they've been... Oh, Stuart, opportunity here! Well, there is a very alert goalkeeper for you. Alistair Johnston. So two minutes of stoppage time here. Marco Tilio. Will he play it in? 
Must be. And a goal to settle the issue once and for all. Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space. And it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. And there goes the final whistle. It's gone the wrong way as far as the home fans are concerned. Well, Derek, that just wasn't good enough today. A lack of a game plan, too many players below par, and not enough energy all around the pitch. A really worrying performance for me. No two ways about it. He really has brought his influence to bear on the proceedings. Well, he did everything today. His energy, skill and movement was just too good for those defenders. It was a really good display.